So Saturday night at the Ritz near Palm Beach, I'm on my own. I see two guys who are around my age sitting at, out at the veranda smoking cigars. How would or should I approach them? Well, it's very simple. And then I'll ask you the question of what are you doing at the Ritz by yourself? I mean, I really don't want them to think you're a hooker. So why would you be the Ritz on a Saturday night without a date by yourself? First question. We'll get to that later. So you see two handsome guys that are in there. I don't know because I don't know how old you are. But let's just say 30s or 40s or for that matter, 50s. It doesn't matter. If they are handsome guys smoking a disgusting, smelly cigar, you have two options. You can go up from far away. First thing I would do is look to see if you see wedding bands on their hand. Even if you do, you never know. They might have a brother or friend, so go up to them anyway. After you notice whether or not they have wedding bands, which, by the way, is only a clue, but it doesn't mean they're not married. It just might mean that they won't wear a wedding band. A lot of those sleazy guys around. Go up and basically say, hmm, two handsome guys sitting out here alone on a Saturday night, I might add, smoking a very smelly cigar, which adds humor to it, where are your wives? And obviously then don't say anything. Make sure you're smiling while you say this and see what they say. The conversation will immediately begin. They will probably be a little bit flustered because you said they were handsome, so they'll smile and laugh. Uh, then they might say, oh, our wives are inside or they haven't come out yet or something like that. Then you go into, well, let me ask you a question. Obviously, you both are married. Do you have any single friends that I would like? Or do you have a single brother or something to that effect? Get involved in some kind of a conversation. You might want to possibly find out where they're from. You might want to possibly find out, you know, so what do you guys do? What brings you to Palm Beach or whatever? Get the conversation going. See if you can do some networking. You just never know who knows somebody. Even when their wives come downstairs, you might want to have a conversation with their wife. See if anybody has a brother, a coworker, a friend. You know, if you want to meet somebody, you definitely have to do some pretty heavy-duty networking because he's not going to come riding in off of a horse. So what you can do is always add humor to it, which is the smelly cigar. Always add flattery to it, which is... Hmm, you guys are very handsome. Where are your wives? And you might be pleasantly surprised. They both might be single. It could be a possibility. They might be there on business. You just never know. So go for it. Okay, Janice, thank you for your time.